criticized in some quarters for a donation you accepted from Rob Miracle's wife. Yep. And you, you, you've, uh, as I understand it, you've uh, both of their names were on the, the donation check, and she, but she signed the check. Correct. And you've kept that money and not given it back. Yeah, you guys remember you asked me that back in May. Okay, I was kind of surprised that it came back up, but then I thought. I heard that it was somewhere on a blog, and so I assumed somebody raised it for a political reason. That's just simply assumption on my part. I'll explain it and tell you. Um, Kim is an Alinsky. That's her maiden name. The Alinsky family lives two blocks from where I live. I've known the Alinsky family, Joe, Jeannie, Kim, her brother, Scotty, 30, 35 years. Billy knows Scotty. Knew Scotty first as a player, outstanding athlete. Absolutely was from the time he was a kid. He caught, played for Frank Henry, okay, in the Teener League. Played on my all-star teams. Tremendous golfer, and he's a good kid. He does that ever remind me that I'm not. Last year, for example, 2008, Scotty Alinsky took his talents, his skill, and joined me and Randy Wesley, and we coached the 13-year-old division in the American Legion Baseball, okay? I have Scotty's phone number on my cell, okay? That's, there are the connections, there are the ties. To the best of my knowledge, unless you people know something different, Kim Miracle did absolutely nothing wrong. She is not an appendage of Rob. She's a separate, distinct human being. She's entitled to respect and courtesy, as we all are. My thought process is this. I know her. I like her. She's a good mother. I know their cousins. I know a lot of the family. Back in May, I didn't think much about this, okay? And I'm certainly not going to turn around and throw somebody under a boat who didn't do anything wrong. That's, that's my belief, okay? Fellas, Ladies, you don't have to agree with me, okay? But that's my belief. Can you understand, though, that some people, Rob Miracle's name is on the check, and Rob yeah. Miracle's role in this corruption scandal, that people could perceive that you have received money from Rob Miracle, whether she signed the check or not? People yeah. Could, could see it that way. Yeah, and you see, listen, I don't even know if Rob knew she signed the check, to be honest with you, because I'm, hey, my wife signs checks all the time, I don't know about. But I don't, yeah, look at I understand that, and I think that's fair. And if people want to believe that, okay, my suggestion is, if you want to take a look at financial contributions, be my guest. There's all kinds of campaign finance reports that were filed for all kinds of elected positions. And if anybody thinks the amount of $500 is going to somehow influence me to make a determination favorable to somebody against somebody else, Obviously, ladies and gentlemen, you do not know me, but the people who support me do. And I don't know if I've answered it, but you know where I'm coming from. Have I you? Sorry. I don't remember having the conversation. Maybe it was with another editorial board in town at, at the time. So refresh my memory. When was the, when was the donation made and, and, and was it something? Back in May, it was reported, and I think your paper covered it in May. And you called me, and I think that's pretty much what I said. And I haven't changed it. And, you know, all of a sudden, now what do we do? Do we respond into every criticism that comes up? Sometimes you make decisions in life, and sometimes people don't like the decisions you make. And look, at I'm, that may happen in the election. Somebody may decide. That's the overriding issue they have. Okay. I understand that. Being a, a longtime family friend, was there any discussion about how this might appear. No, I never even thought about it, to be honest with you. And I'm sorry, did you have related? Have you accepted additional campaign donations from the family? No. Have they offered them? No. 